Hey guys, welcome back to the React Native course. In this video, we are going to talk about how to build custom dialog box or model box in React Native. So let's see how we're gonna make it. Basically, we are going to use button and we're gonna use some UI components like view and the text. And after that, we have to write some styling and we're gonna have a, a button to you know toggle the dialog. Let's see how we can do it. So let me open my VS code and you can see that our project is running. In the last video we have talked about the platform. So let me remove this code quickly and have to type R N F E S. So we got a one component. Okay. Now let's do how, let's see how we can make the dialog custom dialog box in React Native. So first let me add a style to the container, styles dot container. Okay. Now after that uh let's do best flex is a one okay and after that we're gonna have a one button basically button and the title will be let me add a title open dialog okay and let me add a one press event as well and let's see okay cool and let me do the justify content as no let me uh, do a justify content as a flex and so what is gonna uh, do it's it's gonna on the bottom of the uh, app okay now after that let me uh, design our dialog so we are gonna have a view and inside the view I'm going to add a style called styles dot dialog okay now let me copy this property and write a styling for this so we're gonna have a flex is a one a background color is a gray and justify content center and the line items center okay now you can see that we have a one dialog now after that uh, what I'm gonna going to do quickly uh, let's do like this the button on the bottom okay cool now after that we're gonna have a one another view and where we're gonna have a, a model content uh, let me make it sh shorter and let us let write a style for the model content styles dot model content or dialogue content whatever you want to write that's up to you and we're gonna assign a property model content okay inside this we're gonna have a one text component okay uh, hi welcome to zero degree coder okay now after that we're gonna have a one button the title let me add a title close dialog and one on press event quickly okay now we can see this okay now let's style the model content basically background color is a white okay and you can see that some padding is a 20 awesome I think 30 will look much more good and some elevation to look like a model elevation of 10 okay now now it's looking uh, more good and have uh, some border radius of 10 so it becomes circle awesome now you can see that we have created a model and now whenever we click on this close dialog it should get close so achieve, achieve that we gonna create a one state cost so model so model set so model by default the use value will be false okay now after that whenever user click on close so i'm gonna make it false and whenever user click on the open so i'm gonna make it true okay now after that what we're gonna do you can see that this is our component right so what we have to do we have to do conditional rendering here okay so how we can do it so we can do like this if so model is true then only render this dialog otherwise render my 
uh, this button or existing code if you don't want any transparency so if I click on open dialog so you can see that our dialog is rendered and it will get removed from the UI awesome so this is how we build a dialog in react native okay so let's understand let's try to understand this code so we have defined a one state const so model set so model and we have styled a container as a by defining flex one justify content center as a flex end now after that we have defined a conditional rendering if so model is true then render the model how we define the model we style through dialog so dialog has a we define the flex as a one so it will take the whole width of the screen background color gray justify contain align item center and the model color is you know some padding and some elevation and some border radius and we have you know handling a so first of all this button whenever we click on this the sys so model will become true and it will render this code now we can see that we have a text which you can see that and we have a button whenever we click that it will get closed I think yeah that's all in this video about like how to build your custom model or dialog box in react native in the next video we are going to talk about what is packages or what is npm packages and how to install the packages and we will also talk about the what is react native web view package so yeah see you guys in the next video please let me know if you guys have any question or getting any errors regarding anything and please let me know what project you are uh, build what type of project you need to build in the so I will build a series on that see you guys in the next video thank you bye